also uh, co-creator Kathy Taylor is with me in studio. Kathy? Hey. Hey. And we have, uh, it's being documented by Alan B. Charity Films. Uh, Alan is going to be back and forth on that microphone because he's filming too. What up, brother? Thank you so much for having me, Rashad. Thank you all for being here. Uh, let's first talk about, for those who may not know, uh, what is the Power Panel? What do you do? We are a um, movement, and um, we basically are mitigating against human trafficking. Um, it's a horrible epidemic that's going on here in Atlanta, and um, we are implementing a few things, pink boots on the ground, um, but also awareness. So that's the upcoming event that we have. And um, we basically know that we won't be able to end it, but we're doing everything in our power to mitigate um, partnerships with the FBI. Um, we have support from Senator Donzella James, and um, we're just doing everything we can to get out there um, to, if we can bring one person home, if we can um, bring awareness, because knowledge is power, we're doing everything that we can because we are a hub here in Atlanta and so many people don't even have a clue. Yeah. We want to always be helpful and we have been very helpful. We have an event coming up in partnership with the Power Panel. Uh, if you would, Kim, give us some of the updates because you guys started this journey. It's now 2019. What are some of the updates so far? Awesome. Yes. That's my good friend, Senator yes. Donzella James. She's been a public servant for a long time, a remarkable advocate uh, for her district and the general community. So that's that's a good thing. That's a very good thing. Yeah. Absolutely. So House Bill 141 is a... Um, notice that is supposed to be in facilities, uh, whether it's restaurants, gas stations, strip clubs, and um, on it, it has a notice to let people know if you are being held against your will, whether it's to perform sex, work for free, whatever it is, if you're being held against your will, how can you get help right now? There's a 1-800 number, and it's supposed to be posted at all public facilities. Um, a lot of people don't even know about it. And so what we do with the pink boots on the ground is we go out into our community and we enforce it. We go and we check to make sure with the pink boots on, yes, and we go and we make sure that it's posted. Um, again, a lot of people don't know, so it's not that they're being uh, rebellious to it or, you know, not with the movement. But um, then you just have some people that don't care. So we'll make sure, and if they don't have it, we'll supply them with it, and we'll go back and check, hold them accountable. Kat, Kathy, you have uh, worked in this space. You've seen some horror stories. You've been part of successes as well. Give us some of that human angle to human sex trafficking in the city. Well, actually, before I do that, I'm excited that we'll have um, Tony Rivera joining us. And actually, we'll be uh, showing the movie Traffic, which this movie was inspired by true events from her life. So she'll actually be at the event this time. And you'll get to hear firsthand from not only someone who was trafficked, but the trafficker. So it's going to be, you know, exciting and amazing. But, you know, just being in the community, watching some of the things, and just, um, you know, recent events that all over the internet with what's happening with R. Kelly and just different things. It is very heartfelt and we need to get the message out. So we're standing strong on our beliefs and how we feel about this, you know, to raise awareness and exposure on this. So I'm let's, excited. Let's talk about the event coming up in just a few days. Yes, that's this Saturday. Go ahead, Kim.
All right, so let's get the logistics. So that is Saturday, this Saturday. What is the time that people should arrive? 10 a.m. 10 a.m. until? 1.30 p.m. Until 1.30 p.m. Now, yes. that includes a movie? Yes. Now, are we doing it like we did last time? Act exactly like okay. we did last time. So we'll have some food there as well? Yes, brunch will be served. All right, we got brunch, we got movie. Yes. We have a panel discussion, a brief panel discussion after the movie. Yes. Okay. And as my sister Kathy was saying, this time we're going to uh, hear from a person who was trafficked and a trafficker. Yes. All right. Now, who's the trafficker? She was. It was a woman. She was trafficking. The movie Traffic was based. Based on what she did. Right. Three events from her life. Amazing. And listen, that's one of the complexities about this whole thing yes. is that they would take an impressionable person, manipulate them. Right. Make them believe that this criminality is appropriate. They then turn into the same evil that they once were fighting. Right. It's complex. Yes. It's very complex. We got more on the other side. 404-892-2703. You're getting real with the Realist Van on Radio. News and Talk. 1380 W-A-O-K. We'll come back. We'll hit location hard. Okay. And RSVP is, is that RSVP? Yes. Okay. Purchase tickets, yes. And, and how much are the tickets again? Um, 25 is our early bird special, and it's been extended until the 10th. So they have a few more days to get that. And Kim's gone ahead and she went off the line, so it'll just be us from moving forward. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, she just texted me. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. What up, brother? All right, what do you need? The reference, please. 